Welcome back everyone. This video we're going to quickly have a look at frame structures and how um, when we're building roofs and buildings and we're using wood and metal and steel and aluminium and etc etc uh, the different kinds of shapes of frames that, that are normally used. So for example we've got a king post and it is a king post because it's got that central beam running over there with two struts then running to the rafters okay so there are our rafters which the tiles and the you know things like that will attach to on the outside of the roof the struts are giving it extra support and strength the king post is holding it all together and then the tire beam runs from the one wall to the other wall so that's the horizontal tire beam okay so that's a king post What's different about a queen post then <clears throat> is that queen post doesn't have one main beam running down from the top of the roof in this roof truss. It's got two separate little beams. So a queen post then has two beams that connect it. Let's see if I can get it to go into focus a little bit better for us here. Okay, and it's got a collar beam over there. It's got struts for extra support. Two separate little keen posts, a tar beam again along the bottom, and the rafters. Okay, and then the last structure you want to quickly look at are these struts that add the support. This is a fence corner brace. Um, so on the corner of a field or a, a road or whatever it is where they've got fencing, here you've got a fence that's been pushed into the ground. You've got uh, wires connected to it. And you've got struts that obviously are then giving it vertical support so it doesn't fall down very easily. All right. Thank you so much.